Oh, I am in this ring doing my ladies thing. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the sooner I get done, the sooner I get out of this trap hole. November 10th, it's November 10th, and we, yes, are outside to a packed, a packed outside, uh, I don't know, beer garden, I guess, whatever it is. Now we got Sid Dog out there arguing with the people, and he's the star about it. His manager is Stefan that's right. That's right. Holy cows, I'm telling you, who would have ever thought that rock and roll, look at these, hey, let's have a little hook right now, there you go, we got them right here, we got a whoop to do right here, look at this, it's November 10th, and we're outside partying, we're outside drinking beer, having a kind of, wait a minute, coming into the ring, our young, upcoming star here, in wrestling all over the country, but mostly, he's in the army. We're a man and learn to trade because we wrestle 135, 140 times a year. There's no independent company, no independent wrestling, nowhere that puts on as many shows as rock and roll wrestling as r and wrestling. Holy fuck, I am telling you again, it is November 10th. We're outside. We got the Shin Dog, and I'm telling you, the Rainmaker, he's making a name for himself right here. Sharon Montana brought him in. She's over there. Eagle Grove, Iowa. There you go, Eagle Grove. He's talking. That's where we are. Outside. First, I want to thank you for having me here today. It is an honor and a privilege to perform for you. And it's going to be an honor and a privilege to beat the stupid hell out of my buddy Shim Dog. There you go. I'm just going to say, I don't think they're... How dare you come to a great city like Eagle Grove, Iowa, and demean their intelligence? Ah, there you go. He's telling them like it is. Holy fuck. You know, I think I've wasted enough words on you. So, without further ado, gather all your tears and put them in your pocket. Because I've gathered all the rain and I'm about to unlock it. Let's all take flight. Cause I'll be making rain by the end of the night. There you and go. all you rainiacs out there, I have one we question and one question only. What do you think of that start alone? Do you believe uh, he sucks? <laughs> he sucks. Oh, he sounds like one of them. Ladies and gentlemen, he's one of our newest members to okay, rock and roll wrestling. He's here. from I can't believe Minnesota. December, and he November is the 10th, we're outside. Maker. There's the rainmaker. He's the king of the ring at the moment. We got that one nasty light back there. I gotta kinda watch it just a little bit. Because I can rhyme too, and you're ashamed. There you go. Now we got fucking I'm the greatest rhyme ever. Now we got now there we got poetry going on out here. Holy buckets, look at this guy here, huh? God dang, no coat on. Look at the pipes on him. There you go. We'll have to get him in the ring. We got a hell of a little crowd out here tonight. I'm telling you. And like I said before, we're outside. That's right. Star of Love is sucking Shin Dog. I don't know why she's out here. She has no business, really. Don't worry about it. Get that out of my face. Oh, sorry. There you go. Shin Dog decided now it's time to warm up. There you go, Sindog now, raining out of Chicago, Illinois, I believe, this young fella from Atwater, Minnesota. Holy cows, what a deal. Chad Strong, you remember Chad Strong, he's our special weapon. There's the bell, finally. No special time limit, no special rules in this stuff. We're trying to get a little different angle at the ring so you can see what's going on out here. Almost unbelievable. November 10th, that's right, and we're outside. My good, oh, veteran stands. Tomorrow, that's right. I want to thank my own son. I'm telling you, my own son, 13 years in the Army, he's going for the Big 20. My son-in-law's got 10 years in the United States. Uh, he's in the Navy. He's in the Navy. My, my son-in-law and my other son is in the Marines. So I got my boys just about got every branch covered. I'm proud of them. I'm goddamn proud of them. I'll tell you that. My three boys. They serve in three different branches. In the Navy, the Army, and the Marines. I'm pretty happy about that. And, oops. Now we're back. Now he's strutting around in the ring. i never seen nothing like it. What a night. 
There it is, sir. Kind of running it out a little bit there. And they're both in the ring. Whoa! Yes! How did he pull his hair? How pull his hair? Star of Love now is complaining that he was pulling his hair. And the people obviously don't agree with that, I'm telling you. Roll on the red flag, I want to see it. I ain't got a camera. There you go. Like I said, I got to kind of watch. You got that nasty light back there. I'll kind of get a different shot. There you go. Now you got a better view. This is our medium ring. In rock and roll wrestling, this is the only company in professional wrestling that does have four. That's right. Count them. One, two, three, four different size wrestling rings. That means that we can... Uh, if the small, the building is long and narrow, and still do a couple hundred people, but the building is long and narrow, then of course we can bring in one of our smaller stages. If the building is big and square and can hold a couple hundred people, then of course we can take our bigger ring and we put it right dead center in the middle of the building. It doesn't matter to rock and roll wrestling. Whatever the size of the building or the shape of the building, we can fit in the ring that will fit your building. And like I said tonight, we are famous for our rock and roll midget wrestling, but you know our midget wrestling is a mixed up show. Chad Strong obviously in the ring, started up on the outside, and we got the big guys, and we also have lady wrestlers included also. So we have a full night and included the big rig, Chuck Fulton, that's right, 470 pounds, five, a 7 foot 1, 7 foot 1, over 400 pounds, 460, 470, holy bucket. So we got them big, we got them small, we got them all here at Rock and Roll Wrestling. Still got that headlock on it. Pretty basic wrestling here. Nothing nothing really outstanding going on. It's a pretty basic all-star wrestling match. From hell up, there you go. He went from a headlock to a hammerlock, back to a, back to a headlock again. Actually, it was a really nice, clean-cut move. Vern Gagne would be pretty proud of that. Now he's up in the hell. Whoa, big football tackle. Big Viking tackle. Big Green Bay tackle. What is it? Back to that headlock, there it is. Chad Strong, he's a good referee. He's right in there on the action. That's right. Chad Strong's been wrestling with Rock and Roll for almost eight, nine years. Every weekend he travels with us somewhere. He's been dang near all over the place. He did the Japan and German tours also. Until I gotta shut his mouth, I can't concentrate. No, he's hollering at somebody in the front row over there telling him to shut up. He can't concentrate. I don't know what that's all about. But I'm so proud about rock and roll wrestling, actually. November, ooh, big tackle. November 10th, that's right, and we're out, so, oh, reverse the hip toss, look at that. Beautiful move, Jim Dog's on the floor. Jim Dog's on the floor. Rainmaker, Rainmaker, he's got him going, he's got him going. Rainmaker's got him on his side, there you go. There's a bunch of the Rainmaker's girlfriends, I think. I don't know why they're all sitting together. We got a good little crowd here in the back. That's it. We got them here tonight. The Rainmaker on our wrestling. Holy cows, I'm telling you. Now we got the Rain. Now we got Shindog on the outside. He's complaining about the match. He's complaining that he's pulling his hair. He's complaining that he's pulling his trunks. Uh-oh, Rainmaker had enough. Now they're going about. Now they're going about. Star of Love is running around here also with her head chopped off. Whoa, whoa. Oh, he tripped up. No, he didn't. He nailed him on the back. Thanks. You guys got to piss me off, kid. Now he's cussing at him. We got to watch that a little bit. Yeah, you know, the guys in, the, in real life, they don't really know how stiff and hard this ring is. I'm telling you, this ring is not. Let me remind you, this ring is not a trampoline. This ring is board, steel, wood, rope. When those body slams happen and a big slap like that, you better believe it's smarts, boy. And this game isn't for everybody. I'm telling you that. I'm going on 40 years of rock and roll wrestling. Everybody knows that I started one year following Rick Gunny, Jim Brunzel, and also Rick Flair. I started a year or two behind those guys. That's why I'm a little bit younger than them all, and that's another reason I'm still in the game. Hey, hey, now we got Star of Love over here. Look at this. And now she's choking up the rainmaker with that strap of hers. Chad Strong, she's got that strap right there. Chad Strong, she's got that strap. She's got that strap right there. I'm tell I saw it right on the camera here. Then we got a hoot or something, and then he got a big right arm, big right punch. There's the ref. One, two, no! Kicked out right on the last second, I'm telling you. If you remember the All-Star Wrestling days and All-Star Wrestling with Vern Gagne, I'm telling you, that's exactly what you're seeing now. These guys are young. 
These guys are fit. They're in great shape. They're great athletes. Look at that body slam. Made my whole... Shin Dog has got something arguing with the people, and I don't know... I don't know what you call it, but it's a big elbow, I'll tell you. Look like, look like Hulk Hogan with the big elbow. One, two, no, he kicks out. Started up as complaining that the referee isn't counting fast enough. I'm telling you, now, now Shindog is complaining that he's not counting fast enough. I'm telling you, I've, I've seen thousands and thousands of matches, but I'm telling you, there are no matches anywhere in the video. Area, Chicago area, Illinois area, Wisconsin area, Iowa area, nowhere that tops rock and roll wrestling. We are the number one independent wrestling show practically in the whole wide world. Holy buckets, I'm telling you, look at this. Whoa! Hey, look at oh big choke slam, brought him down too. Oh little fast count by the referee. Sim Dog somehow managed to kick out of it. I don't know what to even to tell ya. Whoa, he, oh! he was going to leapfrog him, and you saw what it got him. Holy can of worms, I'm telling you. No, wait a minute, wait a minute. Come on, Starlight. That's not right. What are you doing there? She's got that strap around his neck, choking him and pounding him on the back. Come on, man, look at here. He's holding the referee. He's choking him. It's unbelievable. Chad Strong is only one referee. He can't be everywhere. He can't be everywhere. He's trying. It's difficult. I think Sindog thinks he's got the rain. Oh, gee. He's got the rainmaker where he wants. You notice that? He thinks he's got the rainmaker where he wants him. He's up on the top rope. Wait a minute. Oh, big smack right to the middle of the back. And another one. Here we go. Come on, rainmaker. It's all yours now, baby. Oh, and he hits that turnbuckle hard. Here you go. And look at that. He's going to wheel him again the way it looks. Zango. Oh, there's the clothesline. One, two. Chad's giving him the fast count. They got him in the ring. It doesn't look good for Shin Dog. I think it's over for the Shin Dog. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, look at this. Oh! Wait a minute, Shin Dog. And a nasty headbutt. Knocked him. You can see the stars coming out of their heads. He nailed them. Both of them are. Both of them are laying. He almost knocked out the Rainmaker. I don't think Rainmaker knows where he's at. Shin Dog's walking around in the day. Starla Love is smiling. She thinks it's me. It's not pretty. Uh oh. Uh oh. Look at this. Sharon Montana. It's unbelievable what's going on here tonight. Look at that. Holy cows. It's November 10th of 2012 and we are wrestling outside in front of a packed capacity audience 100 200 there's probably 100 people on all three sides and the one side we have our little our little souvenir market over 300 people here in the night chad now has slowed her back down to a reasonable count now he's got an arm bar you said he gave up! I didn't hear that. You shut your mouth, you stupid dog! Shut up! What? Shut strong right here. I don't know what's going on now. Like I said, you know, he's arguing with the people on the other side of the ring. I think you better pay attention to what's going on in the ring. Start of love over here is smarting off. I'm going to have to slap her. Anyway, now they're back in the corner again. Ooh, he laid in a heavy one. Oh, holy buckets, I'm telling you. What a show. What a match. What a night. Thank you. Oh. I think it's over for the Rainmaker. Two, no, kicked up. Can't believe it. Can't believe it. Star of Love is over here with her whip, and she's complaining about the referee. Now he's got that front chin lock. He's got it clamped on it pretty tight. I'm telling you, Chad Strong's right in on it. He's not choking him. Nope, there you go. Look at this. He's got that front chin lock on him. He's got that front chin lock on him. I don't care. Chad Strong is asking him to be giving up. He, he might give up. He might pass out. I don't know. Referee. Is it out? Going to ring the bell? No. 
He still got him. He still got him. Look at this. Who would have thought? Bam. Bam. Come on, kid. There you go. Small ring, look at this, he's gonna heave him up. Whoa! No! Yes, no, he can't! Yes! He had to position him a little bit more, just a little smaller ring. You saw that. He had to put him where he wanted him. Here it is. Tango. He's throwing him in the turnbuckle. He's gonna beat the oh, wait a minute. There's a reverse. Now He's got him in the corner there. Let me tell you something. There's the referee. To the referee is count. He's going to count to five. He's going to just wait a minute. He shoves the referee. Star of Love is involved. He shoved the referee. What's going on here? Whoa, he elbowed the referee. I don't think that's fair. Wait a minute. Chad Strong is going to take it into his own hands. Yeah, ball. Ball up at this. And a first Ladies and gentlemen, who would have thought we had help the referee? We had help with the referee, but it doesn't matter. Your winner, the Rainmaker. There he is. There's the rain. Look at this crowd. Look at these folks out here. They love the Rainmaker. There he is. Your winner in our first match. We got it. Holy buckets, I'm telling you. Come on. Come on. Come on.